Hi there, Rick with Smart Drive Test talking to you today about the driving task. The driving task are the variables on the roadway that are constantly changing that make hazard perception so imperative when you drive. This is especially difficult for new drivers because these six factors can come together at any time in a different set of combinations that will change one driving situation that will be completely harmless in one day, given day and on another given day completely dangerous. I'm going to be right back and we'll talk to you about the driving task. Hi there, welcome back. Talking about the driving task today, the vehicle, the driver, the road, traffic, light and weather. These six factors change on a constant basis. Drivers, for example, can be young, new drivers with very few skills and very little hazard perception abilities. 20 to 45 people who have physical disabilities, people with only one eye have no depth perception and need to employ other techniques to compensate for that reduction in eyesight. Other people, uh, seniors for example, will have uh, reduced physical abilities, lots of driving experience, but you probably have all had the experience of driving behind senior drivers, older drivers who are driving slowly. So the driver is one of the factors and the driver can be in any sort of given emotional state on a day. The next variable for the driving task is the vehicle. Vehicles can be in any sort of mechanical fitness on any given day. Tires are bald, the brakes have not been done for some time, uh, brake lights are out, lights are not working. So like the driver, vehicles on a roadway can be in any sort of mechanical fitness shape as well. So that's another factor that you as a driver are dealing with. Roadways. You can drive out of your driveway in the morning, be on a two lane residential quiet 40 kilometer an hour street, very quickly move on to uh, a main artery through your residential area, two lane much quicker 50 kilometers an hour, out onto a four lane that's 60 or 70 kilometer, uh, kilometers an hour and then be onto a freeway driving 100. So the roadways change all the time and the configurations change all the time. And really the only guidance that we have for being on roadways is lights, signs and road markings and it's imperative that we pay attention to those. Traffic, we have seven different kinds of vehicles on a roadway that comprise to make traffic. Trucks, buses, cars, uh, passenger vehicles. Uh, in some cities we have streetcars and trolleys, uh, bicycles, pedestrians and the new addition to traffic on our roadways is seniors on scooters. These are being seen more and more in traffic. So be on the lookout for seniors driving on roadways on their little electric scooters. Light is another factor. Light can change from nighttime when you can't see, glaring sun, uh, middle of the day, cloudy, overcast. All of these factors change how our light uh, varies from any given time of the day. So if you're driving long periods of time, the, chain, the, the light is going to change dramatically. And just as one example, at nighttime, human beings lose about half of their ability to see. There are lots of uh, road infrastructure pieces in place that compensate for our, ability, our, our less ability to see at night. For example, reflective signs, uh, reflectors on the roadway to mark them out and those sorts of things, but still it's greatly reduced. Finally, the last factor is weather. Weather can change any given day, especially for those driving in mountains and other remote locations. You can go from rain to freezing rain to slush to snow, bright blue skies. All of these things are changing. So the six factors in conclusion are the driver, the vehicle, traffic, the roadway, light and weather. These six factors can change at any given time and in one situation will be completely harmless in another given situation they will come together and you can be in a very dangerous position. I'm Rick with Smart Drive Test. Thanks for watching and remember, pick the best answer, not necessarily the right answer. Have a great day. Bye now.